everyone, gather around. Chibi Maruko-chan is about to start. Maruo-kun aims to be like Hanawa-kun. Good morning. Good morning, Maru-chan. It's quite cold today, isn't it? Huh? Tama-chan, so what are you reading over there? Oh, yeah, this. It's a story about Santa Claus. Mm. That fireplace looks so warm. You know what? I wish I had a fireplace in my house. I'd spend time in front of a nice brick fireplace reading a comic book or drinking hot chocolate. That's nothing different from what you usually do every day. Everyone, I shall start today's lesson by handing back the test we had last week. Oh, no. Uh, I don't have any confidence in my score. Me either. There were some Chinese characters that I didn't know. It seems the test was a little difficult for you. There's only one person who earned a perfect score. I know who it is. I did perfectly in the last test. 100 points, the perfect score. Frankly speaking, it must be me. There can be no one else. Huh? You did very well indeed. Uh, he not only looks cool, but he's also smart. He earned 100 points. You're so amazing, Hanawa-kun. Huh. I guess Lady Luck just happened to smile down on me for the test. Ooh, I studied so hard, too. I'm humiliated. Here, next. <laughs> <laughs> Maruo Seo, you must do it today. You must get over the force that Molding Horse do it. you leapt over the five-step vaulting horse. Tell me how you managed to leap like that. Hmm. I just imagined myself as a bird flying over the sky. We wouldn't have a hard time if we could leap over imagining ourselves as a bird. <laughs> oh, now, Okun, are you thinking about running to be class representative next term? Uh, what is it, Maru Okun? Oh, now, Okun uh. is our class representative. Wonderful! And then I could do all the duties of a class representative with him. Uh, yes, well, I really don't have that intention. Mm -hmm. I may not look like it, but I'm quite busy every day. I need to look after my pets, and I have lessons for foreign languages. Besides, in the wintertime, I've settled myself in front of the fireplace, and I cherish those moments when I can indulge. Fireplace? By fireplace, you mean one that's made of bricks and has a chimney attached to it and Santa climbs down? Yes, that's right. That's why I'd rather not try to be the class representative. That sounds like Kanawakun. For sure. Oh? <sighs> for the sake of the election for class representative next quarter, I need to study the daily life of my rival, Hanawakun. Hanawakun, if you don't mind, may I come to your house after school today? I need to spend some time in your presence. Uh -huh. I would like to observe your day closely and see what really makes you tick. Oh, this will be a great chance to feel the warmth of a fireplace. Hey, I'm curious to see what a day in the life of Hanawa-kun is like, too. Yes, I would love to spend time with you, too. Uh, sure. I guess that's fine by me, guys. 
Hey, Tomachan, you should come with us as well. I'm sorry, but I have to stay home to house it today. I see. I'll let you know how amazing and warm the fireplace in Hanawa's house is tomorrow. Maru-chan, so your objective is the fireplace. I'm home! Oh, hi, Maruko. The kotatsu has been heated for you. <laughs> you mean you're satisfied with that shabby kotatsu, baby? Ah. Uh -huh. Well, I'm going out to experience an amazing dream world that a kotatsu can't provide me. Hmm. A dream world that a kotatsu can't provide? Even a warm kotatsu makes my heart feel cold from being alone. By Tobozo, a haiku of being left behind. Welcome to the residence. Young Master is waiting this way. Hi, glad you guys came. Right now, my darling Victoria is getting groomed and dressed up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, look at that. She even greeted us. She's so smart. She'd get along well with my Amaryllis, don't you think? Ooh, ooh. Frankly speaking, I've never seen a dog being groomed and dressed up before. Hey, uh, by the way, Hanawa-kun, so uh, which room do you use to space out in front of the fireplace? Uh, no, I don't space out in front of it. I just think. But the fireplace is not available right now as the chimney is being cleaned. Sorry, but we can't use it at the moment. Oh, just my luck. Uh, William, can you greet my guests properly? Bonjour! Amazing! Bonjour. That parrot greets people the same way as Hanawa-kun does in French. I've been taking French lessons in this room for quite a while, so he has learned it as well. Even the parrot speaks French. Bonjour, Bonjour Kazuhiko. Bonjour. Bonjour, Pierre. This is my French teacher that I've been talking about, everyone. Bonjour, everyone. Uh, uh, hello, 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 Pierre. I know. Why don't you join me? I'm about to have one of my French lessons right now. Is that all right with you, Pierre? Oui. It's my pleasure. Oui. So let's have a lesson about basic greeting. In France, when you say hello to a girl, it is bonjour, mademoiselle. And to a man, bonjour, monsieur. Try it. Monsieur. Yes. In French, monsieur is the word you use when you address a man. Mademoiselle means miss, and it's a polite form of greeting. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Bonjour, monsieur. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Oh, miss? So Kura-san isn't really what I consider a miss to be. Are there any other words for her? Wait a minute, Maruo-kun. What do you mean by that, huh? Uh, no, no, Sakura-san. Listen, Maruo-kun. All the ladies in the world should be addressed as miss. They're all beautiful and elegant. Right, Pierre? Oui, he's right about that. You see what he said? I'm a beautiful and fine mademoiselle too, understand? Oh, uh, yeah. The reason Hanawa-kun is popular is because of this. In comparison, I still have lots to learn about how to talk to people. Uh, if Miguel-san didn't want to play tennis in pairs, I wouldn't need to. Uh, I want to warm myself by the fireplace. I've never played tennis before, but I, Moroseo, should try hard in order to make myself like Hanawa-kun. Well, let's begin. Here. Here. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Mademoiselle, frankly speaking, you should do better. Uh, thank you. Here I go. Take this! That it went really far away. Huh? D don't worry, I'm going to find it for us right away. Just a little more, almost got it. Maruo-kun, did you huh? find it? Oh! Oh, oh. Maruo-kun, are you all right? Oh. Oh, frankly speaking, I'm completely drenched. How are you feeling, Maruo-kun? Please make yourself warm and comfortable at the fireplace. <sighs> Finally, the time for this has come. My dream to chill out by a fireplace. <laughs> it's like I'm in heaven now. <laughs> My thoughts of you, Mikiwa-san, burn as hot as the fire in this fireplace. Mm, don't tease me like that, Hanawa-kun. Uh, well, what's going on there, baby? 
Oh my, what am I doing in this plush robe sitting by his fancy fireplace? And the new class representatives are me and Hanoa-kun. I will work hard to meet all of your expectations. Yay! Here, have some hot chocolate. I have realized that I'm no good. Uh -huh. You see, I was jealous of you, so I observed you all day today in order to be more like you, Hanawa-kun. But in the end, I'm no good. Maruo-kun. I'm no match for you. You're just too good at everything, Hanawa-kun. <laughs> hey, wait a minute, Maruo-kun. You are very earnest and you try very hard and, uh... Well, you have many good points that make you unique and cool. That's right. In any case, you're just asking for trouble if you compare yourself to Hanawa-kun. How silly are you? Nagiwa-san. Sakura-san is completely right. Your virtue is that you are always earnest and you try your best at things. Everyone is different in their own way. That's what makes us special, right? So then everyone is different? Yes, that's right, Maruo-kun. You should be you and no one else. Sakura-san. That is right! My best qualities are that I'm earnest and I always try my best. Frankly speaking, is there anyone else who is more fit to be our class representative than me? <laughs> Anawakum, what a dashing smile. Yes, my best quality is that I'm truly devoted to my love. <sighs> I will cherish my best quality, which is being carefree and lazy. There is no one Maruko else and her friends are enjoying this cozy moment in front of the fireplace, thinking about what they believe are their best qualities and characteristics. In this episode, Sis becomes obedient to Maruko. Yippee! I finally saved enough! I have 300 yen now. You really saved that much, you sure? I hope it won't rain tomorrow, then. Say whatever you want to me. I went to all this trouble for the sake of Momoe-chan. <laughs> ah, Momoe-chan. I tried really hard to get this. I held back my desire to buy snacks and juice. I saved all my pocket money for a good 10 days. Ah, wonderful. She is really super amazing. Ah, Momoe-chan. You're just the best. <sighs> It's over already. Oh. Huh? Huh? Hideki's autograph. Oh. Uh. Uh. It'll be given to three people by a special draw? Oh. Takiko, I want you to have my autograph. Hideki! Uh. Maruko, give me this application stub. Uh, let me get my scissors. Uh, well, what are you going to do with those? Cut it out, of course. I'm going to apply right away. Well, wait a minute. This is my magazine, sis. It's only a corner. You can give me a little part of that page, right? No way. Although it's just a corner, it's mine. I finally managed to buy it, so you can't cut it. Why are you so stingy? It's fine. I won't ask you any more, then. I'm going to buy it myself and send in the application later. Oh, sure. Suit yourself. Try and buy one. Huh. Hideki, I'm going to get your autograph, and I will treasure it forever. The next day. No, this isn't the one. Uh, excuse me, do you have a copy of Myoban featuring Momoe-chan? Uh, that's the last issue, miss. Sorry I don't have it. <laughs> do you have it anymore? No. Sorry, I don't. Uh. 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 My treasure is gone with the wind! <laughs> You're making a mess again. <laughs> you have to clean up your room by dinner time. You got that? <laughs> Mom is so annoying. Huh? Hey, Maruko, I need to ask you a favor. Eh? That copy of Miobon isn't sold anywhere anymore. Eh, oh. Can I have the application stub for Hideki's autograph? Hey, wait, sis. You told me yesterday that I was stingy and mean, didn't you? You said you didn't want to ask me for it. Uh, um, sorry about yesterday. 
Maruku, I beg you, please give it to me. You know, it's very rare for Sis to ask a favor of me. I should milk it. Okay, fine then, Sis. Will you give me your share of today's snack for it? Sure. All right. Wait here. Um. Great. Let me have it. Uh, did you think you could have it for a snack? Uh, wasn't that it? You are too soft. In fact, you're softer than this nice sweet bun, Sis. Well, come on. You can help me do my homework now. How dare you? This is no longer sold in any stores, is it? It's a precious commodity. I can't just give you a part of it so easily, even if it's just a corner. <laughs> All right, fine then. I'll help you do it. <laughs> I wonder if Sis will get angry if I ask her for more. But this is such a rare occasion. All right, I should give it a try anyway. Oh, and Sis, clean up the room for me and do it by dinner time. Maruko, don't get carried away. <laughs> Oh, are you sure about that? Should you talk to me like that when I have this? Just take a look. Hideki, in order to get your autograph, I shall endure this treatment. Here, it's wrong. Look, you've got to calculate correctly. You're so hopeless. Ah, you called me hopeless. Because you did that, I won't give you the application stuff uh, today. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, my, you've cleaned so well, dear. <laughs> I'm almost done with my homework, too. Well, I guess you can do it right if you try. Okay, dinner will be ready soon. As long as I have this, Sis will do anything I tell her to do for me. <laughs> the next day. We have lots of homework today, don't we? I guess I can't watch any TV tonight. No way. I'm watching TV. I'm sure I can finish all that homework very quickly if I ask Sis to help me do it properly. No problem. Right now, my Sis is acting more like my puppet or my servant. What? What do you mean, my puppet? Well, I've got something she wants. <laughs> Grandma! I want to draw another lot right now! Hiromi, you've had enough for a day. No way! I want to draw more! I will draw until I get the Junko card! <laughs> I'm home now. Welcome back, Maruko. Uh, are you actually greeting me? <laughs> For today's snack, we'll have some delicious looking jelly that we got as a gift recently. Wow, jelly? And I will give my entire share to you. What do you think of that in exchange for the application? Sis is making her move, but I must have an aggressive attitude to beat her. Ah, uh, I have lots of homework today, and it makes me so sad. So then, sis, will you help me with that? <sighs> All right, fine, then. <laughs> Man, it's delicious. Ah, how lovely is Momoi-chan. Well, here is the gift corner. Today's gift is an assorted set of freshly squeezed fruit juice. Hey, that looks so delicious. The application is valid with tomorrow's postmark at the latest. What does valid with a postmark mean? Oh, ah, the postmark just means the date printed on a stamp. In this case, valid with a postmark of tomorrow means that they don't accept applications with a stamp after tomorrow. Mm -hmm. uh, can you give me that for a sec? Hmm? Oh. Well, that's it then. So. No, no! Uh, Maruko, are you still trying to hold off? I mean, what do you want me to do? Do you expect me to keep obeying you forever? Well, I just, uh... <sighs> I can't help it. Then tomorrow's snack will be the last thing I give you. I'll give it to you in exchange for the application. Am I clear enough? <laughs> you promised. Remember that. <laughs> and the next day. <sighs> what should I do about this? Hey, Sakura-san! Uh -huh. Stop goofing around. Do it quickly. Uh -huh. I will draw till I get the Junko card. Hey, Maeda-san, do you happen to have a picture of Hideki? Uh, Hideki? I need it pretty urgently. Do you have one? I don't have one. Uh -huh. This is bad. I'll be in trouble if she sees it now. Huh? <laughs> Are you all right there, ma'am? Uh-huh. Maeda's grandma. Sakura-san. I'm fine, thank you. I just tripped. Here you go. 
Ah, uh, thank you so much, dear. Goodbye, then. Oh, wait, but this. <sighs> no way. She will find it quickly if I hide it in here. I must find a better place to hide it before Sis comes home. <sighs> Some place where she would never look for it. I'm home. <laughs> here, my share of today's snack. Uh, well, since you mention it, sis, to tell you the truth, I lost that copy of Meal Bun that you want. Uh, wait, what are you talking about? I saw it here yesterday. Uh, don't tell me that you're still intending to hold it over me so I do your homework. No, no, I'm not. It's really gone. I promise it is. Uh, maybe a thief broke in or something. <gasps> hey, Moroko, I found this under my cushion. Is it yours? Hey, mine! <laughs> Please, oh please, please let me win this draw. Let me see. The address is. Oh. Oh. Hey, wait! So it's past the deadline already? <laughs> I'm very sorry. I didn't have any ill intentions. I truly uh. didn't know about the expiration. Maruko! Good afternoon. Ah, uh, uh, Maeda san. Sakura san, my grandma said thank you for all your help. Here, these oranges are for you. They're super sweet. Wow, thank you. And also this. Here, I won it today. Hideki, I finally won Junko as well. Here, Sakura-san, you can have this. Uh-uh, thank you so much. Sis, but please have these. Mm -hmm. Hideki! <gasps> <clears throat> <clears throat> Since I gave you these, will you forgive me? Oh. It's so soft. Maruko, you are softer than this orange. After that incident, Maruko ended up being a servant to her sister for one week. <laughs>